and officials expect to see a lot of illegal fireworks this week, so they are trying to find some new ways to put a stop to them. A fireworks task force will be targeting residents who do break the law. 8 News Now reporter Shaquilla Alvarenga is live near Sahara in Maryland with a closer look at this valley-wide effort. Shaquilla. Well, Denise, these safe and sane fireworks right here, they are the only legal ones. You can find them at these pop-up stands across the valley. Several local departments will be in different neighborhoods to make sure you don't have any other ones. Our guys will be out there patrolling just for illegal fireworks. Um, and we'll be giving tickets and, and we'll handle it how we see fit. And just how much money will a ticket cost you? Up to $1,000. It's one of the main um, complaints we get during this time of year, and not only on the 4th, but before and after the 4th. Metro Police posted these photos on their Facebook page. An officer is seen standing behind several confiscated fireworks. In this one, a speeding ticket wasn't their only problem. After police found this in the driver's back seat, the Northeast Area Command also confiscated these fireworks in just a few hours. Even though they weren't lit, the driver was cited and their fireworks were taken. It's been a, a major problem in the Valley for a while. So to get a handle on it, it's going to take years. And so that New Year's Eve is always a high, high call volume. So is freeing up units to get to those firework calls um, so we can stop and prevent some of those tragedies. Instead of calling 911 or 311, you can report illegal fireworks complaints online at iSpyFireworks.com. In 2018, the iSpy site logged more than 25,000 complaints. This data is used to document problem areas and plan future law enforcement efforts. If the fireworks consistently went up in the air and, and blew up how they're supposed to, then we wouldn't have we wouldn't have this issue. And if you're wondering what illegal fireworks are, they include firecrackers, Roman candles, and skyrockets as well. Reporting live, Shakela Alvarenga, 8 News Now, back to you.